Welcome back to the channel everyone. I thought this would be the quickest and coolest way to give you an update on the status and news of the production surrounding the Detail Death Star dioramas you see in this picture. So things have moved along very nicely. The machine shop has uh, ha had all hands on deck to get the parts for the first 75 kits I ordered made. Uh, for your reference, currently 65 of the 75 kits have been sold. Uh, I just wanted to show you the unfinished uh, cut aluminum because it just looks so beautiful. Don't worry, all the machine parts, uh, the machine marks you see here will be gone once it's been purled and finished. We've managed to track down the exact color, guys, uh, used for the actual Death Star paint. And uh, we found a professional finisher who will apply the base color for us in a special enameling type process that will really make the finish very tough. Uh, it will be baked in an oven, so even though some parts will afterwards also be shaded and uh, weathered with an airbrush, the base coat is just the, the toughest we could find and we're proud to offer this upgrade at the exact same price that uh, was initially quoted. We had to up the number of units we ordered, but that way we could uh, do it at the same price. The Perspex parts have already been cut as well. And here, let me introduce you to my father. Some of you might already know because I've told them that uh, he's helped me in the past with uh, products especially the large diorama uh, in production. He's retired now and he loves helping me with this stuff. And even though he doesn't understand all the English, he loves reading about all the excited responses from the community about our product, so that's cool. Right now you're watching him apply the special LED strips we've managed to source for this project. And because we had to order a staggering 1640 yards of the stuff, we could get it made to our personal specifications. So, uh, yeah, that's pretty cool I must say. Um, another thing we could source as well were the custom power supplies. Now there's another couple of cool upgrades that are free of charge for you guys because the price isn't going up. We ordered so many that we could get them made to our specifications. Uh, these are world power supplies so anywhere in the world the kit is sent to it will adapt to the voltage coming out of the wall there. Uh, but that's not all. It has enough power on tap that for everyone who's ordered more than one kit for more than one shelf in the Detolf, which seems to be a very popular option, you can now power several kits with one adapter if you wish, so you don't have a, a great number of wall warts at the bottom of your Detolf. Also, the plugs you see here will be included in every kit you order. So you just slide on the one that is relevant for your country and uh, you've got a power supply that works anywhere. So that's cool. You can even take your detail on the road, people. Hey, who thought of that? So here's another cool upgrade. Every ceiling panel, uh, which you see the top of here, will be beautifully finished in this black foil. So once the LEDs are applied and then the uh, aluminum grid is glued in place. It doesn't matter where you place it in your detail, you will also have a clean looking top. So I thought that would be nice to share. And here you are looking at the prototype of what I'm hoping will be the Series 2 Deluxe Diorama background. You see, we've decided that we really want a limited edition for every series. So we have the current Series 1 of the Deluxe and the budget. And once a hundred of them are sold, no more. So you know they're going to be limited. But another cool thing is if we get to a new series and you like uh, many people, by the way, want several shelves, you can get a different design. On the left here, you see the typical uh, design you see not only on the Death Star, but also something similar in Episode 7. So you might even use it for that. Um, so this will be the design for series two which means that you can have uh, at least four different designs on your shelves with this left side uh, changing and maybe other parts of the design being changed depending on the series so as long as things stay fun and manageable uh, we will continue doing what we're doing just for your reference right now we've ordered 75 kits and 65 of those have already sold so it looks like um yeah there's a good chance we will be doing 
a series two of course you can imagine 75 kits is a lot of work even for two people so this is a sneak peek into what uh, i hope will be the future and speaking of future projects let me give you another couple of sneak peeks first off a sneak peek into what might be the next project for a detolf diorama yes you're looking at a detolf diorama first designs for the tentive 4 that has been a much much requested design um, i can tell you that it was a bloody nightmare because as you can see we need to get those white perspex parts exactly bent into the right shape to get that yeah r almost round tunnel look and the, those parts all need to be hand bent to an exact radius um, but it seems like even though every kit has to be hand bent we have managed to figure a way to offer this it's going to be more expensive because of all the work than the death star diorama but um it's been such a very popular design that i do think many people will uh, will really love that with a with the uh, round back door uh, the custom design stickers with um the the pillars it's going to be awesome i think then let me give you a sneak peek into one of the other future products uh, projects for this youtube channel i'm assuming many of you are familiar with this figure it's quite old it's the t1000 from terminator 2 and one of the very popular custom projects i've done is create the frozen liquid nitrogen version of that and i will be showing you in a video tutorial exactly step by step how that is done and guys while we're in the frozen environments another request from someone on facebook who follows me is could you do a chewbacca hoth which is also a project i will be doing both will be for sale so if you're interested hit me up before i can promise it to anyone else uh, so thanks again uh, please share like subscribe get this word about the channel out to as many people as you can and you can support this site for free by using the affiliate links below anytime you want to enter amazon or sideshow thanks